Hi, this is Sebastian Katz from Audio Bro. In this video, I'll be demonstrating the Load and Purge feature, which is debuting with our last Legato Sordino library. So what is Load and Purge? Well, in contact, I've loaded a Sordino Violins A Legato LPG instrument. And of course, the LPG stands for Legato, Portamento, Glissando, the three different kinds of note transitions I have available to me. It's important to understand that each one of these note transition types is actually a discrete set of samples, and having each loaded adds to the memory requirements for the instrument. Right now, I have all three loaded, and you'll see the memory requirement is 277.16 megabytes for this particular instrument. Well, what if I don't need portamento, or I don't need glissando transitions? Well, that's exactly when you would use the load purge feature. Let me show you how. On the left-hand side of the instrument, you'll see the note transition types written in italics. To the right of port and gliss, you'll see two triangles. These are actually drop-down menus. I'll open up the glissando menu. Inside, there are four options. Let's go over them one at a time. The unloaded option will completely remove this note transition type. You won't be able to play any glissandos, but you'll also reduce your memory footprint significantly in this case, from 277 megabytes down to 176. The next option, DFD, stands for Direct From Disk. When I enable this option, I will be able to play glissandos. However, I won't have any control over the length of the glissandos. If you do need that speed control, that's what the last two options are for. The difference between speed light and speed is the amount of RAM required and the amount of control that you get. Speed Light offers a really nice balance between control and RAM. As you can see, we're back up to 277 megabytes. That's how these patches ship. The last option will add additional RAM onto this requirement. It will also give you a bit more control over the length of the transitions. In this case, we're up to 342 megabytes. And that's really all there is to it. The Portamento menu works exactly the same way, has the exact same options, and you can mix and match these exactly how you want. You can unload both for a super light patch, or set these both at speed for the most robust patch available. As a final note, you can also see that the play velocities ranges are auto-updating, meaning that if I remove the glissandos and the portamentos completely, the velocity ranges auto-update so that they all play legatos. As soon as I add an additional transition, they update again to make sure that there's room for each. I hope this helps a few of you out there. If there are any questions, please feel free to write us on our private user forums, and I'll see you next time.